Welcome to my art channel. I'm Mo. I love to draw characters. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Make sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe. <laughs> give it a thumbs up. <laughs> After 72 videos, I'm finally a YouTube partner and this is so exciting, especially for you because now you can watch an ad in front of my video. <laughs> Just to realize guys that after you watch this ad, you can now watch another ad because this video is sponsored by Skillshare. So if you don't know what Skillshare is, basically you have this online learning platform um, with thousands of classes, drawing and painting classes and probably my favorite art class so far by Gabriel Piccolo. If you don't know me, he's this huge Instagram artist. That's what I enjoy the most about drawing. Hi, I'm Gabriel Piccolo. I'm 24 years old. I love this class so much. I watched it several times actually. Um, and in case you want to support the channel and want to learn some more, uh, check out the link in the description because Skillshare is offering my community, so all of you, two free months of learning and now enough with the shameless plugs and let's come to what's actually good for you three minute thursday is now free for everyone to watch on youtube which is super exciting for me and today guys i'm going to show you how you can draw amazing looking legs what in three minutes without knowing anything about anatomy this is clickbait isn't it it's actually not it's my favorite art technique and once i learned about it i never went back to do anything else it's it's so let's put three minutes on the clock and jump straight in guys. We can draw a lot of things just with straight lines and curves. We use lines for bones and hard structures and for everything else like muscles, fat and flesh for example, we use curves, okay? So that's actually all you need to do. That's the tutorial. No, just kidding guys. Uh, now let's take a look at a leg. Now, the leg from the front, just a straight line. And the outside of the leg, because the upper leg on the outside has a lot of muscles, we have a curve. Then comes our knee, which is the straight line. And then we have another curve for our calf muscle that just shows on the outside. It's that easy that we have drawn a leg. Now let's take a look at the leg from the side. So from the side, it's a little more Difficult, but not really difficult or anything. So we basically have the butt Which is obviously a curve then as I said our upper leg has a lot of muscles on the front So we have a curve here and then at the back of the upper leg There is not a lot of muscles, so we have a straight line then we have our knee which we just will draw with a simple triangle shape like this the back of the knee just with a straight line then we have our lower leg bones so we just have a straight line and then we have the calf muscles again that you see here on the left side we have on the back of the knee then we're just gonna draw really simplified feet because this video is not about drawing feet that when you want to draw an in-between view of those two you just have to see is there more of a bony structure or more of a, a flesh or muscly structure so we have the slight curve on the outside, then we have our straight, then we have another curve for the calf muscles, another straight. Now if we bend our leg, uh, then the muscles of the upper leg will actually flex, so we have like a really extreme curve. Then we have our knee again, which is just still our triangle. Then we have the calf bone and the front, so we have a straight line, and then we have the muscle part the calf muscle actually ends at one third of the leg and there it's just like tissue and some stuff then let's add simple feet and just a straight line here now you think that doesn't really look good uh, but if we add now just the basic leg from the side view what we already learned let's draw a curve for the upper leg muscles then our knee Let's draw a straight for the back of the upper leg, another straight, then another straight for our calf, bone, bone, and then the muscle part, and then a really simplified feet, like this. Now those don't look too good, but 
I do them like in a couple of seconds. So let's take a look at, for example, at this artwork. Uh, you can clearly see the same technique. I just have the curve, then the straight line, then the straight curve, and then actually the feet, we will take a look at another time, but it's basically the same. You have one straight line and then you have two curves actually here. But same on the other leg. Straight, two straights, then a straight line for the lower leg and for the back of the lower leg. The muscles are just this curved line and then just a straight line on the top of the foot again. I can see this really perfectly here where you have the straight line then you have the curve here the straight line the curve so i use this technique all the time and it's so quick it's so fast it's the best technique i've ever learned about i hope you like this video guys and um yeah give it a try and let me know what you think and uh, hopefully see you guys in my next video bye bye